I'm about to get toxic. Yeah, let, let's let's up. <clears throat> this is from all Willard right, I got H. Telling me I'm Keith a kid. Smith. <laughs> Violence in all of its forms is poisonous and destructive. My behavior at last night's Academy Awards was unacceptable and inexcusable. Jokes at my expense are a part of the job. But a joke about Jada's medical condition was too much for me to bear, and I reacted emotionally. I would like to publicly apologize to you, Chris. I was out of line, and I was wrong. I'm embarrassed, and my actions were not indicative of the man I want to be. There is no place for violence in a world of love and kindness. That's Big Willie coming out right there. Um, I would also like to apologize to the Academy, the producers of the show, all the attendees, and everyone watching around the world. I would like to apologize to the Williams family and my King Richard family. I deeply regret that my behavior has stained what was what has been an otherwise gorgeous journey for all of us. I am a work in progress. Sincerely, Will. Man, I ain't gonna lie. I know most of the time when celebrities apologize, we just we just like don't give a. F Bro, y'all y'all be acting like he formed the motherfucker beat his ass. He <laughs> smacked him, bro. Like like can like can we register with actually he smacked the man. Yes, yes, there is legal consequences. You can't just Yeah. Him. He was out of line. He was 100%, out of line. And he apologized for it, but <laughs> as he should. As, as, he should. as he should to be again, I said he's morally wrong. Yep, he needs but to. like yeah, yeah, some motherfuckers is dragging it. Like I, I already know there's some people in so, chat. So I want to I want I want to be clear. What he said right there means that it was just a joke. He said he, he said he said yeah. he said he, he said but he's saying that he knew that he knows that jokes at his expense comes with the job, which is that it, what I've been saying, and the reason why he took it over the line for him is just specifically because of that joke. That joke was a reason, nothing else. But if even if we think that he's lying, I just want to be clear, bro. Uh, like, bro, Chris, Chris, um, uh, Chris Rock told a joke that honestly wasn't that bad, but you can clearly say it might have been distasteful because it was about someone's disease. Understandable, mm -hmm. understandable, right? Okay. Um, you slapping her, are you getting up? You laughing first, and then your wife looking at you, then you getting upset. Totally a dynamic that most people who've been in any type of long lasting relationship understands. I get that. The audacity of you though to step up on a stage. Knowing that you have a history of making fun of people yourself is crazy, Nick. You can't participate in the shenanigans, and then when the shenanigans come at y'all expense, or y'all don't y'all don't benefit from the shenanigans, now all of a sudden, nah, we can't do that. Cracking jokes on everyone all fucking night, and y'all pick and choose which I want to not not be made fun of. Now again, though, if it's specifically about that joke. I can understand why somebody felt like that's crossing the line, but the idea that oh, I just oh, I just it's just it's just too much for me. Grow the fuck up, get some balls on you, and maybe that maybe Jada will stop fucking August Alcine. How about that, nigga? Drop that's the bomb, V Souls. Jesus Christ. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Well, let that one sit. Let that one sit. Toxicity is getting. Okay. Toxicity Island shit sit. This shit was trash. <laughs> I, I, I don't think it's completely ass. I I just at the end of the day, I I agree with most of the people that don't fuck with what fuck with what he did. But it's like, bro, it don't really fucking matter at the end of the day if you that's like true. what he did or not. It, bro, that's how he reacted, and I don't think his reaction is such a negative thing. That's my whole stance on the thing. No, nah, he's, he's bringing us black people back. Bro, what, stop. What, what, stop. Legend you, of ain't winning. That, you ain't mean that shit. Listen, stop legend it, of winning. Stop legend of winning. Reference the leg. This is the legend of winning. Um, he referenced. Will Smith making fun of people in his past before. How about I this? Wanna... How about this? How about this? Omar, shut up. It's 1,500 people in here. Drop the ball, Ooh. nigga. Oh, wow. I'm running this show now. Can you confirm that? 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 Can you confirm that with the hundreds? 16, Are there hundreds on the, on a piece of paper? No, we don't know you. Fun we fact, don't know. 1,500. This guy's Listen, bro. This guy's our host. I'm just saying, if it's my show, I wouldn't talk to me like that. You're absolutely right. This bro, <laughs> let's keep it real. Let's keep it a buck. Crazy. Legend crazy. of Winning reference some of the the, the shit talk that Will Smith has done in his life. Let's let's talk about it because some found it ironic when this clip surfaced earlier today. Like he has a rule. The bass player, he got a rule. He got to wax his head every morning. That's a rule. <laughs> he follows the rules, man. He follows the 
Wallace Lewis. Oh, these are jokes. Come on. <laughs> See, you got too into the characters and got hurt. <laughs> now, that was Willard. Mm, what? I'm so Smith confused. I'm icing, I'm icing, I'm making fun of a bald head man. On live television. Are y'all really gonna give it up or y'all just gonna bullshit, bro? <clears throat> I ain't, I ain't bullshit. Listen, let me bring let me bring somebody let me bring let's somebody let's, let's, else let's up. Talk about it. Let me bring somebody also, else up. Real talk quick. about the fact that it's because it's two men. That's another reason why it's acceptable. <clears throat> but we know that we know yeah. don't care about yeah. men. Let's yeah. talk. Yeah. Let's, let's also talk about the that. fact that because it's two black men, that's another reason why it's acceptable. Yeah, that's right. We've I, had that I, I conversation that. as well. Because yeah. a white, because a white woman disrespected a white man's wife that same night, and nobody gave a fuck. No one gave a fuck. Oh, yeah, right. nobody did not give a fuck. Three, three. And Anna, Anna, you Anna, Amy, and on top of that, the reason why, even though that that with the joke that he made, because we don't know if the the gentleman is has alopecia or not, but he just bald, right? But at the end of the day, the nigga still made fun of his appearance, not knowing who the fuck that man was. And then when somebody gave a, oh, well, that's a little, you know what Will Smith's response was? Dog, it's a joke, dog. It's a joke. It was two different things, though. Two In two it different eras. That, wanna... that shit was when we all were in diapers. Well, Lowe was in high school. But we all were in diapers back oh, then, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so we were all in diapers. I want to bring this up. I want to bring this Thanks for watching. Let's keep it a buck. If you like that clip, go ahead, check out this video right here on your screen, and we'll catch you on the next one.